day everyone so today i will be teaching you how to add a watermark in a document particularly a picture watermark and a text watermark and of course how to remove both kinds of watermarks so let's start so as you can see i have here doesn't support a double recipe now I want to put first a picture watermark on this special recipe first thing to do is to go to design top then in the upper right corner you can see watermark click on the command watermark under watermark you can choose default watermarks such as urgent disclaimers and confidential for example since this is a recipe i will choose the watermark confidential so as you can observe the watermark which says confidential reflected at the back of the recipe now aside from that you can also customize your watermark first is to put a picture watermark but how can we put a picture watermark so this is how you can put a picture watermark on a document first go back to the design tab click watermark down below a command which says custom watermark so in here we can customize our watermark first let's try picture watermark click on the picture watermark click select picture then it will direct you to browse on your desktop to go to your OneDrive or to search online. Now in my case, I will go to my file. Look for my picture. This one. Click insert. Now if you want your watermark to be transparent, click wash out. But if you do not like your watermark to be transparent, do not click wash out. In my case, I will click wash out. Then you can also choose how big your picture watermark will reflect on your document. In my case, I will choose 50 and let's see its result okay so it's very small as you can see the watermark doesn't TV reflected at the back of the recipe next how do we put a text watermark customized text watermark on a document Go back to the custom watermark and click picture watermark and then choose text watermark. Under text watermark, you can choose different languages. Since I am a Filipino, I will choose English Philippines. Next, we can change the text of our watermark. In my case, I will write Dazen TV. Okay, change the font styles. You can customize the size of the text or the watermark. In my case, I will choose 80%. And aside from that, you can also choose different colors. Since my favorite color is royal blue, then I'll choose royal blue. And I'll click OK. If you want your text watermark to be transparent, 
you can click on semi transparent but if you do not like then you unclick semi transparent in my case I will click semi transparent and I'll choose horizontal instead of diagonal layout and I'll click OK or apply okay there you have it dozen TV watermark reflected on the recipe doesn't support a double recipe but what if we want to change it then go back to design tab click on watermark you can either click directly removed watermark or go back to the custom watermark and then click no watermark and it will automatically be deleted or if you want to change it like you want this one to be small letter then you can then you can also change the color then click apply or ok there you go That's how we can add water on a document and how to remove that. That's all for today and see you to our next tutorial.